from um, the church up to the Gilsland Spa Hotel, saw these plaques. So uh, historically, there was a convalescent uh, home area here. We've just come across all of these memorial um, plaques of uh, various description and various ages. Yeah, we used to love to dance here, it says. Yeah, so the dance hall in the Gilsland Hotel, um, there's a big uh, concert hall there. Um, and this lovely old building here that sadly is kind of a bit run down. Um, uh, like an old sort of coach housey sort of area at the end there, isn't it? So there's a lovely little remembrance bench under this tree. Oh dear, it's toppled over. Oh uh, yeah, 1915 to 1996. Beloved husband William Henry Smith. Many happy hours spent together at Gisland. Oh yeah. Oh, hang on a minute. Look at this I've just found. Sorry, just there. Uh... Oh, let me come down a bit. So, this plaque is unveiled by Mrs. Florence Cowling's National Executive Committee to mark the official opening of this garden, planted to com commemorate the centenary of the, co the Cooperative Women Guild, 19th of March 1983. Uh, commemorate the Diamond Jubilee of the National Guild of the Co-op. So there's a definite co-op theme going on here. This is 1926 to 1986. Uh, okay. Oh. So I just noticed um, an arch, I wasn't sure there's an arch into somewhere, or just a random rose arch. There's some description here, into another bit of garden. Imagine. Oh, crispy leaves. Oh, here we are, another, um, another bench. National President, uh, 1985, oh, hang on a second, 1985, 1987, didn't say um, the year of the bench or anything. So that's the um, little area I was just down where the other bench was. And I'll come out here, oh here we are. Oh how pretty is that? There's another, um, another bench in the way. And so we're into um, autumnal colours and flowers. Uh, there you go. That's a uh, yeah. I'm just looking at this here. A lover's bench, Sandra. That's a little, little uh, interesting walk, Sandra. Would you say? Mm. I was just looking at that. It's a real grand tree, isn't it? Real grand tree. Look at that there. So this is the back of the um, Gislin Spa Hotel. Um, so as I say, we've walked down there to the church and the um, stepping stones. And there's a sheep field and there's a a sheep. Hello, sheep. Me. Uh, a very relatively still, lovely day um, to be out walking. So I stayed here in February and it was raining, bleaky and extremely windy when I came. So, coming to the front entrance of the hotel and that's our car, where our car's parked, uh, there. And the path down to Silver Spa. Silver Spa? Sulfur Spa is down on the other side. So there we are. So we're on the uh, uh, front entrance. So there have been historically some quite big bowls and dances here, Sandra. Uh, yep. So again, with this co-op um, theme and smoking shelter. Oh, this is the Galloway Bar. Yeah, so that's where um, I ate and uh, some to, to drink in there. But in here, there's another little peaceful garden area. 
and it's dedicated to the National Guild of Cooperative to commemorate its past president member of the National Guild of Cooperatives. Oh, the NGC, National Guild of Cooperatives. There you are. So, so we're in a Covid season, so that's the Galloway Bar, so normally that's actually open, you can stop off there for a drink. Um, so this is around the, the rear of the hotel. Open now, so I'm not too sure whether that's staff accommodation or I'm not too sure. Okay, so that's the real. Oh, you can see this from the road. That's a commu that's communication tower, so water tower, isn't it? And they are. Water supply. Pretty future, though. Yep. So, um, water supply. So let's go back to the car. So, when we walk down here in a bit, Sandra, you're going to come to a very old uh, pumping station. Uh, so my hunch is it was pumping water up for the hotel, and that possibly now rings right, doesn't it? Mm. Possibly.